Hi, I'm Cindy from BeDanceWear.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to fade with paint. It is a wonderful technique to learn how to use if you're intimidated by regular dyes. Uh, you can really control this method and create a wonderful effect that nobody else will have. So when you're fading with paint, you want to make sure the paint is washable and that um, so it won't fade off or flake off. I always add some textile medium and I'm going to use the same brush. It'll help with the technique. These shorts are wet, so it'll create some blending. We'll start with the lightest pink first. I'm using this pink to get to that tone and just slightly change it all the way down. So we're gonna start with the lightest color first. And I want this to be on one side and kind of go down. So we'll go to the front of the shirt. Now be careful when you're doing this because I accidentally set uh, this on something that had some blue on it. But for this purpose, we're going to cover that right up. You won't even notice it. It works great to change a pair of shorts that have been messed up too. So the shorts are very wet right now. And so we're going to start the lightest color. And just paint that on. And sometimes I'll take it and just rub it and squish it together. This is a very, very light pink. Has some glitter in it. This blue will actually end up getting covered up by the rest of our design. So I'll just keep going down. Remember, as you put the darker colors on, it will change a little bit. So I want to go a little past so that the next color kind of blends into it. So that's this color. Just keep going, and I'm going to keep part of this white just for effect, but now we'll mix a little of this even in. That'll help a lot. You want it really to blend. And just keep it going. Then we'll go on to the next color. See how it's getting darker and darker? The thicker paints will work really well as you get down to the darkest one. So the darkest one I want to go to is this cranberry. And then blend in the middle. Keep it blending. People will think that you bought the fabric like this, but the key to it is to keep it soft and not hard. So that's where the textile medium comes in very handy. And just blend it up like that. Sometimes I like to kind of go in and give it a little. Now we're going to rub that out. Got too dark. I'm going to rub that out a little. Let's go ahead and. Just keep going like that. So when you've done the whole thing, then I like to just. I'll take it over the sink, I'll roll it up so it stays in order, and then you kind of squish it together. So you don't see the brush strokes anymore. All you see is the color fading down to the bottom. Thank you for watching our video, and if you enjoyed it, make sure and click here to subscribe because we're going to have some amazing DIY videos coming out. And if you want to get our free, complete, dance costume DIY guide, click right here or go to bedancewear.com slash DIY guide. And lastly, if you have any questions or ideas for future videos, please leave it in the comments below. Thanks again for watching our video. And remember, be original, be colorful, bedancewear.com.